Hi, I'm Jack Hanna, Director Emeritus of the Columbus Zoo and Aquarium. You probably know me from my work with animals, but you might not be aware that my daughter Julie was diagnosed with leukemia at the age of two. By participating in the Pennies for Patients program, your school will join thousands of other elementary, middle, and high schools working together to bring hope to people affected by blood cancer. So obviously, you know, it's loud down here, which is why I'm glad it's downstairs. You know, it's full of color. There's puppets, there's puzzles, there's coloring sheets, there's a train, there's guinea pigs. I want kids to feel like the library is a fun place to go and get books and that books are part of the fun. Coming from a small school, you always wonder, was the academic preparation enough? Was it good enough to survive in college? That everybody's seeking the universal through the particular. She didn't like lecture and she like didn't do like discussions where everyone just sits and writes and then throws in an opinion every now and then. She'd like start out with something crazy, like she'd just throw it out there and then everybody would just back and forth what they think and what they what they come up with and I think that engaging people is really, really effective. One of the biggest and major issues that I faced was, you know, trying to find somewhere to live. Sometimes children um, are not adequately represented and I want to be able to be that person to go in, be their voice for them, be their advocate. This was earlier in the poll vault, watch this. The favorite up and over Abigail Schaefer. Earlier this afternoon, we had the men's high jump competition and the winner was Ethan Miller, a junior from Central College. Here at Daco Appliance Parts, our motto is, we sell customer service, we get paid for the parts. I happen to choose the activator method, an instrument adjustment. It's a low impact, high velocity type of technique. We are a family owned mom and pop automotive service center. When you come into the Petro Tire Center, you're gonna see the same faces every time. <laughs> 